What's up, E3 Off-Road? Hey, what's going on, guys? All right, so we're super excited because the Fall Maris event is finally right around the corner. Yeah, it's it's coming up real, real fast. And we have a ton of stuff planned, like more planned than we even did on the previous one, which was a blast in and of itself. It was, but this time we're gonna have a ton more trail rides, everything from mild to wild. Should we tell them about? Hold on. Okay. First off, if you've never been to the Maris Adventure Park, it is part of the, or it's least, least located in the Palo Duro Canyon, which is the second largest canyon in the United States. And it is absolutely beautiful. If you didn't know that it was located in Texas, that's you, fine, because most never, people don't know. I know, most people don't know. And if you see photos of it, it's, it's mind-blowingly beautiful. It is absolutely amazingly beautiful. It's up in the panhandle and it's flat. And even you get there and you're like, what's going on? Where I don't am I get this. And then you drive another couple hundred yards and you're like, Oh Holy my God, crap. I found Narnia. <laughs> like, it, it really is like, it's like a portal to another world. It's absolutely breathtaking. And like Kevin said, there are going to be a ton of guided trail opportunities, both from mild all the way to wild. And speaking of wild, part of what's going to make this one really special is we're going to have a VIP option where you guys can join us on our first ever attempt on the Light Bright Challenge Trail. Yeah, so, so... We haven't actually, we haven't driven it. We haven't even we haven't seen, seen it. We have seen the trail. But, well, but, we, we saw what was supposed to eventually become the trail. Yeah. So, but so, we don't know what it actually looks like. So Dirk is the owner of Maris and we went and walked it last time we were there and he goes, I'm going to turn this into light bright trail. So this is going to be for your bigger Jeeps. Yep. Um, probably 38s and up. Yep. Um, lockers, rock lockers. sliders. We don't want anyone getting, you know, damaged. Winch. We, you have to have a capable rig to join us on that trail. But it's going to be a smaller group. But for those of you who aren't quite that built, there's going to be plenty of opportunities, not just to go off-roading, but they also have a ton of hiking and biking trails as well. Not to mention and some really... Exploring. Yeah, and cave exploring. And some really rad camping spots too. It's... Guys, this it's event... A whole, this is a whole experience, right? Yes. This isn't coming out just to go off-roading on a couple trails and that's it. This is a whole experience from, like she said, hiking and biking if you want, cave exploring to all these trails we're gonna have like live music yep. we're gonna have tons of food breakfast lunch Dude, and dinners this is gonna be incredible and we can't wait to see all of you guys there now if you aren't familiar with maris and you haven't seen our past event you haven't seen the videos revolving around the past event go ahead and check this out To be able to come out to a playground like this has been absolutely amazing. Um, and uh, guys, thanks for building this playground so much. I mean, this has been wonderful. I had an amazing experience this weekend. I got the opportunity to meet Kevin and uh, Brittany and it was very cool. Um, this is my first, I'm a very much a novice to this sport. And um, this is my first experience with these kinds of trails. And I couldn't believe how things fit, how those Jeeps fit in any of those areas, right? And so the teamwork we had on our team to get everybody through was amazing. Everybody was so helpful and just super friendly. Enjoyed meeting the people I met. Um, I couldn't have asked for a better crew to work with. It was very cool. I will come back anytime for this. Yeah, I got my heart pumping, but boy, it was fun. <laughs> uh, working with them, I mean, Kevin and Brittany are awesome. I mean, Kevin is an incredible driver. Brittany can spot anybody. Perfect. Now, hard, hard, hard passenger. Yep. Yeah. Everything you see is genuine. I mean, she just, all she wants is you to have a good time, and she's never going to put you in a spot where you feel unsafe. She's just going to coach you through it, and then watching Kevin do it, you're like, Oh, really? <laughs> he makes it look easy, but then you go and do it, and you're like, well, the way they spot you and the way they have you do it, it's like, well, 
it wasn't as bad as it looked. It's like, wow, I can do this. This is pretty cool, so. Just getting to come out here and learn a little bit more about wheeling. I haven't driven a Jeep in 40 years. Uh, so to come out here and the first thing, first time I get to off-road a Jeep is in a place like this, with people like this, has been just absolutely wonderful. The whole event was a huge success. You guys had fun, right? Yeah. I just challenged the heck out of the stepchild right now. Like we haven't even been over here yet. We brought the VIP guys out here to kind of learn from us. Yeah. Like Brittany was spotting, I Off was trying cuff. to drive, and it went pretty well. I enjoyed it. The Jeep's still good. This park is insane. This this is so much fun. Honestly, and we're so stoked to do it again in the fall. This was we couldn't have asked for more. Everyone behind us did amazing. Everyone on the trails with us all day long was amazing. This entire event was a lot of fun. We can't wait to do it again, and we hope that a lot of you guys will be at the next one to come hang with us out on the trails. See you guys next time. Bye, guys. Woo! Guys, I hope that pumped you up as much as it did us. Like I said, the last event was fantastic, and this one's going to blow that one out of the water. Yep, you don't want to miss it. And there's no guarantees we can keep doing this in the future, so I would, I would definitely get on this one. Guys, can't wait to see you out on the trails. Later, guys.